welcome back to the channel in today's video I'm sharing with you my fall nighttime skincare routine I'm gonna be sharing with you all the products that I am using some are old some are new so I'm gonna give you the details definitely check out the description box below just in case when I'm going I forget to say something I can give more details on where to find what I'm using um, in the little description down below. So, I'm drinking my hot lemon water. And I know I'm supposed to drink this in the morning time, but your girl does not like to drink hot lemon water in the morning. It is not the vibe. I wanna brush my teeth and drink coffee as soon as I wake up. And try the lemon water it's just mm -mm. it's a no so i've decided to start doing it at night and i knew that i have started and i definitely can see a difference so i'm going to be sharing with you um the products that i'm using and majority of everything that i have tonight is going to be from well, no, not majority. So, the soap that I use, I'm going to have to put a picture of it because it does not look like what it did when I bought it. But it's from Bell & Soap. It is the detoxifying and clay mask soap and the turmeric. So, I actually combined them both together and like um, made like a concoction. And... I've been using it on my skin, I would say for the past couple of months, because I was using CeraVe, or CeraVe, however you want to pronounce it, and I liked it, but it wasn't like, it wasn't making a big difference. So like, if I didn't wash my face, I couldn't tell like, oh, I need to get back into washing my face every night because... I'm seeing the difference. No, I did not. So, I was like, this, I gotta find something that really, really makes a difference. And so, I know that turmeric is good for the skin. It helps to brighten and clarify your skin. And then, um, the owner of Bell & Soap is the one who told me about the clay detoxifying, um, soap that she had. So, I shot with her quite often and she has a lot of soaps that I've tried a few times and so I was just in there for some bath bones and then I ended up getting that so I definitely have been liking the results so far and then I also have a face serum that's what Bell & Soap but I'm going to go through each step and show you what I use and yeah okay so as I said the soap I'm going to put a picture up so that you can see it and um see what I'm using and Mm -hmm. 
and I love the lather that it gives. So that was just three strokes with me wetting my brush. Like it is already like very, very soapy. And you can see the color of the turmeric is gonna be like a, a orange, yellow, gold combination. And then the detoxifying clay is a gray, like a charcoal gray. Mm -hmm. And so that's what I love about this, the lather that it gives. Because some stuff that you use, it doesn't give you a good lather. But this, it does. And I love it. The suds are coming down my hand. Like, I love it. Love, love, love it. It's my fine. And I've been using it for a while and it does not stain my brush. Like I've used a few products in the past and it and they have stained my brush. So that is something else that I love about it. Cause I use it just about every night and it hasn't stained. And you're supposed to like change out those brushes like every couple of months. But if it stains, of course, it makes you wanna just get rid of it sooner. Okay, I also have right here, this is my face steamer. And I have it on. I plugged it up. And I'm going to steam my face tonight. So I actually steam my face two or three times on a good week. But I think you're only supposed to steam it like once or twice a week. But three times has been working for your girl. So. That's just what I've been doing so far. So I'm gonna put this right here. This stain my face. That is the very, very refreshing. Next, I go in with my toner. This is the Rudy, uh, Rota Beauty um, Organics. This is the toner that I also use in my skincare morning routine. And so I just spray it over a couple of times. And then I take a cotton swab and just it in so that it can get into the pores. After I do my toner, I go in with 
a face serum that is with that is from Bella soap as well. Now this face serum is made with the five key ingredients that you need for your skin. So if you Google what essential oils you need for your skin to help your skin be moisturized, it's in this bottle. The only thing that's not in this bottle that I have added in is hyaluronic acid. That's it. But you don't have to use this, but I use it because I just like the combination. So this is from World of Beauty. And it has vitamin C and vitamin A and green tea. It is a moisturizing serum. So I put those two together, a squirt, and just work it in with my Gashua. So I've already set it in the freezer, like when I know I'm about to start my skincare, skincare routine, I go ahead and stick it in the freezer in the evening time. Now in the morning time, because I'm just forgetful, so you can just get a cup of ice and stick it down in there. So it can be cold to your skin. Your skin will love you for it. So either way, but in the evening time, I just always remember to stick it in the freezer. So that is what I'm about to apply next. And it only takes a couple of drops. A little goes a long way when it comes to these serums. Hey, baby. Hi. Hi. Hello. Hi. Hi, baby. Okay, get down, baby. Get down. Mm. Let mama finish. You're supposed to be getting ready for bed. Okay. And I'm going to use this peptide and collagen. It's an anti-aging serum, but I don't use this every night, but because the babies have been sick and your girl has not been getting sleep like she should, I'm going to put some up under my eyes. I did have a, another kind, I think it was like L'Oreal. And it was cold, and it was uh, an eye serum with collagen and peptide, but I couldn't find it this time uh -huh. because I don't use this up. Like sometimes I can have stuff for like a whole year if it's a good product and it doesn't take much. Then when I go back to find it, it's like gone or it doesn't look like the same bottle or it's like new and improved and I'm like is it really so definitely need this tonight but I don't do it every night or you so sad Okay, now normally I would go in with my oil 
I usually use rose hip oil, but it are this serum has enough oils in it that I don't have to go in with an oil to seal in the moisture. However, I've been doing some research on I'm not even going to try and say the name, but you can see here it is supposed to be the elite honey for your skin. And so I've used it a few times. Now that it's fall, I want to like prepare my skin for winter when it's like very, very cold outside and it's harsh and in the summer, in the winter time, I don't drink as much water as I should. In the summertime, of course, we live in the south, it's hot, so I'm, I'm staying hydrated. But I can't say the same. Oh, I got too much. I can't say the same when it comes to the winter months because I don't really thrive in the winter months. And I like my water cold. And if I'm cold, I'm not drinking water. And I don't really like it when it's temperature either. So, yeah. I'm actually not, uh -uh. I'm just like at the faucet hydrant drinker. Like I like sparkling water or bottled water. For many reasons, but taste is number one. So, mm -hmm. but yeah, so I've been using that for the last couple of weeks, and I really, really like it. That is something new that I've just put into my regimen. But like I said before. I look for different moisturizers when it comes to this time because you want to make sure your skin is getting the moisture that it's going to need when those like December, January, February come around and it's like just brutal and harsh on your skin. So, she call her somebody. And this is just like an overnight lip serum because your girl has dry lips. I get that from my father. I have his lips. And no matter what I do, they always dry. And certain lip gloss dries it out even worse. Comment down below if you know of a good hydrating lip gloss just for like every day it doesn't have you know it don't have to have like a tint or anything but I'm looking for like just throw on and go something like chapstick but cuter all right you guys that is it I'm going to put this up and Get this bathroom straightened up and put my rug wraps to bed. That is going to do it for my nighttime routine. Thank you all so much for watching. And make sure you're subscribed. Check out Bell and Soap if you are here locally. And make sure you tell her that Amanda sent you. I will be putting the information down below. So... Excuse that. See, it's my bedtime. It's time to go to bed. And I think it's... My camera cut off. <laughs> yes, sir. Thank you all so much for watching. And I will see you in my next video. If you're not already subscribed, make sure you hit that red subscribe button. And join the family. Definitely just follow me on Facebook and Instagram at Amanda Amore Wine. And... I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.
Sometimes you fall. Sometimes you fall.